Okay, let's uh, solve problem uh, 3.20. Okay, this is a problem with uh, viscosity. You're told that you have a uh, viscosity at uh, 100 degrees C is equal to uh, 10 to the 14, 14 poise and a viscosity at uh, 1300 degrees C is equal to 10 to the 11 poise. Find the activation energy. Okay, uh, two parts of the problem. First is, is a unit uh, management, and the second is finding the energy. Uh, so we know that we're dealing with Arrhenius-like equations, right? We're dealing with something like this. Like this. And the activation energy we're interested in is that guy. Now, Arrhenius equations, typically there's a negative sign in front. And remember, the reason we don't have a negative sign, instead this is plus, is because we're dealing with... Uh, viscosity, and uh, the Arrhenius equation with the negative sign in front is the fluidity, and the fluidity is one over the uh, viscosity. So that's where the positive sign came from, but that's okay. It's still basically the same procedure. We want to separate these out, and we'll separate these out by taking the natural log of everything. That gives us the natural log of the viscosity is equal to the natural log of A plus the natural log of the exponential of Q over RT. So that's going to be the natural log of A plus Q over RT. And then we can arrange that again to the uh, natural log of the viscosity is equal to Q1 over RT plus the natural log of your prefactor. And this has the same functional form as Y is equal to M X plus B. So that is just a line. So if you have the natural log of your uh, viscosity versus 1 over RT, we'll have two points. All right, we'll have two points and a line. The slope gives you M and the intercept gives you B. Great. Uh, now, the trick with this is you have to make sure that you have the units right. And the reason we have to have the units right is because we want to make certain that our units are consistent with useful energy units and the gas constant. And we do not have useful units here. So we need to convert our units first. We need to convert uh, poise into Pascal seconds. So one poise is equal to 1 times 10 to the minus 1 Pascal second. So we've got that in our base SI units. And the second thing we need to do is we need to convert uh, degrees Celsius into Kelvin. So perform your unit conversion. 
plug two points in, find the slope, find the intercept, and the slope will give you the activation energy.